Words. Hi everybody. You'll have to forgive me. I have a little sensitivity to the sun, so I'm just gonna pop this up. But I'm Mandy. I have a small herbal business called XOM3 Botanical Solutions. I also run a community organization called Roots of Healing. Both of these endeavors started as a hobby. Um, it's a practice in Western herbalism, and if you know anything about plants, there's lots of things we can eat, which is what I love about coming to see Mr. List, but there's also lots of things that we can use for medicines, for aromatherapy, for skin. So there's lots of ways we can use different plants for our wellness to have a more complete health profile for support. So coming up, I have a few different events I wanna let you know about. And you're also welcome to sign up for my email newsletter if you'd like to just take that information home with you now, that's fine, but we'll also be sending out our newsletter this weekend. This next weekend, we're gonna be meeting with our mutual friend, um, Elliot, over at Cottonwood Urban Farm. He has the most beautiful little farm in the Central Valley, and I'm gonna be teaching infusion. You're gonna be infusing plants into oils. Now, I'm sure Mr. List has done this before because he's also an herbal practitioner, even though he's first ag. Uh, but if you're infusing different plants into oils, you can use those in lots of ways. I'm sure you've had salad dressing, right? Yeah. Okay, so you can use it in a culinary capacity as a marinade, a salad dressing, maybe something you wanna dip your breads in. There's lots of ways to do that. There's also skincare. I do make a lot of products in my business and those can be things that can be nourishing, healing, so we wanna learn how to use these different plants with oils in order to make products for ourselves at home. I will be teaching this course next Saturday at Cottonwood Urban Farm. So you'll be able to get information on that by my email or if you'd like to go on to the website or our Facebook group. After that, we're gonna be having some pop-ups. We have a meetup that Mr. List has been able to come to and my nickname has come from that for him. Miss Nettle. <laughs> I learned everything about Nettle from this young lady. Does anybody even know what Nettle is? Yeah. Oh, Stinging nettle. nettle. Nobody oh, likes no. it. You want to get rid of it. She's changed my mind. You There's don't want to get rid of it. Things. Good tea. Totally. It good makes tea. a great tea. It makes good pesto. You can use it in support for allergies and other things like that. So there's lots of ways to learn what's around you, whether it's something you cultivate like a lavender or rosemary or something that seems like a noxious, annoying, stinging pain in the butt, like nettle. So we're gonna be learning more about that kind of thing. We have the Meetup Roots of Healing that meets at Moby's Organic Tea and Coffee in North Hollywood. Woo! -hoo! And they've been hosting us for four and a half years. That's a donations only event. So if that's something you're interested in learning about, that's gonna be much more about how to use those plants, how not to use those plants, what they might be good for. There's lots of things we can take in during that event. So go ahead and sign up if you have questions, please let me know. I do also have my business card over there and I have some books out in case you're wondering, well, what is Western herbalism? I'm sure you've heard of Ayurveda. I'm sure you've heard of Chinese medicine. They are all great modalities. This is just a different group of plants, things we'd be used to from our area or from Western Europe. So you can take a look at some of my favorite books there and you can ask any questions. I'll be over there for a little bit afterwards. Let's give Mandy a big hand. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh.